Hey guys, and welcome to the video, and I hope that you are feeling awesome. Alright guys, i got to confess, I am not feeling 100% up there right now, because I've got to go back to work tomorrow, and I have enjoyed all last week being off on the uh, holiday with Yvonne, getting things done. Today, I have to confess, it is going to be a very, 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 well stressful day i suppose you might as well say that is i've got a vlog to upload and also i've got to help yvonne get the rest of this window done well guys i've had a bit of a crazy morning right the last clip i left you guys i went inside and uh, i cracked on with that editing i said i was doing right and then i was hearing some noises outside and it was realized it was uh dini playing around in the garden and I thought, oh, I'll go outside, you know, maybe, you know, capture her doing that. And it was only till I stepped out and I was like, what's that? And I felt rain on me and I was like, oh, oh no, no, you're, no, you're no, kidding me. Kidding. And so then literally I legged outside, put the umbrella up. And then what I've had no choice to do is put this bit of uh, plastic up here and then wedge it into place onto the frame. The problem is, guys, the frame has got this sealant going along there at the moment and all the way around the outer of it up here and all the way around here, right? But this bit of the frame all the way around hasn't been uh, sealed yet. So as you probably can tell, I was literally cacking myself this morning and I was like, oh my God, I best do something. And then as soon as I'd done that, guys, it stopped drizzling. You two playing? Yeah. You get it, Dini Juice. I suppose it is safer having one of those because they do uh, hurt when they catch you with their claws. Well, anyways, we're going to leave Yvonne and uh, Dini playing a game of tug of war. I want to show you the window. Now, we've literally finished doing all the sealant and everything today. And I must admit, it was a nightmare of a job. It's not the best job, guys. We'll have to admit that. But I will say one thing. It was really, really good to learn how to do all this. So, like I said in last week's vlog, we are learning as we are going. So I'm hoping, guys, that the next holiday that me and Yvonne are going to be on, we're going to be able to get that one done. So, at least this side of the garage will look all nice and smart. Wow, guys, the sky this morning is absolutely beautiful. And I must admit, that crack in between the clouds there it looks like a crack in time. But anyway, guys, yesterday, me and Yvonne were speaking to her mum, right? And uh, she says to me, she goes, John, have you got an early start in the morning? And I'm like, I always have an early start. And she was like, oh, yeah, drats. And I was like, why? And she goes, the moon tonight apparently is supposed to be like this special moon, right? And I'm like really and uh, apparently when the moon comes that close to the earth it gets really bright and it's uh it's just fascinating and i gotta confess i have set myself up a time lapse last night and i'm hoping guys fingers crossed it turns out to be an awesome video absolutely fantastic guys i was so hoping it was going to be looking a lot better once i got to work and wow the sky is definitely not disappointing to be this morning however if you notice it behind me we have kfc sort of coming along and it's really hard to imagine this plot of land that was there before this big it only looked like a tiny little bit of grass Guys, the weather's definitely changed since this morning, and I gotta confess, I'm not too sure if I'm gonna go out after work because how horrible it looks. Because something I was looking to do today, like I said to you previous, is the fact that I want to look for different locations to do time lapse videos and such like. Also, there might be a, the occasional time I might be able to get some great pictures from that location as well to share on my page. But I will say I'm having a great shift up to now, guys, and everything is going spot on. And I can't wait to get a bit of food inside me and uh, give Yvonne a bit of a call to find out what she's been doing today. <laughs> oh, my, oh god, my god guys i am absolutely sweating my knackers off guys honestly but anyways wow what a day i've had and also guys remember this there's always a positive lining to anything
Wow, guys, I cannot believe the weather we have for the next uh, week ahead. It is going to be absolutely boiling. And no word of a lie, I wanted to go out on Tuesday to do an adventure video and look around the certain area that I wanted to go to. But with the temperatures, it's going to be like that. There is no chance I'm going to be doing that. Um, I've got to be honest, I haven't looked at the uh, video of the uh, moon. And uh, I'm looking forward to seeing what comes of that video. If it's a, a good video, it's definitely going to be on both the page and the channel. But anyway, speaking of page, um, I uh, hope that you guys enjoyed watching my first adventure video. I um, feel a little bit embarrassed because of the quality of the editing and such. But also, I feel proud because, you know, it just shows of what, you know, my progression, I suppose. Wow, guys, the sunrise today is looking awesome. And what's even more better about today is we have Yvonne. Hello. Good morning. <laughs> hey, good morning. Well, when you watch this, it could be whatever time it is. Me and Yvonne just know something about the KFC here. Well, that's one good looking gazebo, I think. <laughs> or something here. I don't know what this is going to be about. But, guys, honestly, look at that. Look at the progressions going on here. Well, anyways, as I said, me and Yvonne's going to head on in and uh, hopefully, fingers crossed, both of us is going to have an awesome shift. And then after that, guys, we've literally got to do a bit of a rush around job because we've got to get home, get ourselves changed and get back in the car and go pick up the new car. So I don't know how you feel. I feel a bit upset, a bit emotional right yeah, now. Yeah, a bit of both really, isn't it? Yeah, it's a bit strange feeling right now. Wow, guys, the weather today has been absolutely on point. But unfortunately, can't pick up the new car yet because all the uh, details haven't gone through correctly. Like, you need to cross the T's, dot the I's type job. I'm just gonna wait for Yvonne because she's just popped into town to do some bits and bobs. And then I suppose me and her is gonna make our way home and figure out what we're gonna do for today. Wow, guys, I gotta say, I am doing something that I've been wanting to do for months and months and months. Now I've been at work, I've came home, got myself changed, and I'm about to take you guys to do a little bit of drone flying. I cannot wait, guys, for one, seeing what pictures I can get, and two, what video I can get. It's going to be fun. So if you haven't already checked out the pictures, they're already on the page right now. Please go and give them a bit of love, and uh, it'd be great for you to maybe give me a little bit of a comment. So uh, anyways, let's get up in the air. Oh my god, guys, I cannot believe what's just happened. I was flying the drone, everything was going great, right? And then I suddenly thought to myself, oh, I best bring the drone back to base, so to speak, and see how the battery level's going, right? 
and then all of a sudden it said return to home. Where the drone got was literally just before this tree ends, the bush down of it, so it comes this way, right? It went straight up in the tree once, I couldn't get there in time. Then all of a sudden it went back up in the tree. Let's just say, I feel like I failed this mission today. I had so much stuff I wanted to do and this is just really, really screwed it over for me. So I'm gonna pack myself up, head home, and see what I can do. And in the hopes, guys, that I might be able to uh, get this sorted as soon as possible. I'm not being funny, it's not a huge priority of my life right now. I've got plenty of other things I could be fixing and sorting out and stuff. But let's just say this was something I wanted for ages, guys. And now I feel like I've lost the freaking will to live. I really have. So I'm gonna go home now and try and figure out how the freaking hell I'm gonna repair this drone. It's just... Ugh. Well guys, what can I say? There's two things I want to say about today. Not only one, it's freaking hot, honestly guys. The second thing is, we're saying our final farewells to Betty here. So I'm going to take a drive now to get the new car. And I decided I wanted to call it Sky because it's blue. <laughs> okay guys, I'm now here and I must admit it is so friggin' hot. And I must admit, I'm feeling quite emotional about leaving this car here and saying my final farewells to this car. Well, guys, I'm now sat in Sky, and I must admit, this car is really, really good. And uh, i got to be honest, it's not far off the same size as Betty, but we've got a little bit more boot space, which is fantastic, especially for future DIYs. Well, anyways, I'm going to send Yvonne a message now to let her know that I'm on my way home. Hello, don't know if you can see me. Hope you can. Hello. So today is a very happy day because we're getting a new car. So it's happy new car day. So yay. Um, I'm just waiting now for John actually to come back. And what he doesn't know is I'm going to be waiting outside for when he arrives. And I believe he's parked up now, but what I can hear. Hey, uh. And this is Sky. Howdy, hello. Hello. Yeah, we're going to come and have a look. I'm going to shut the door first. It's a little breezy. It's like, this is a new car. Ooh, we are bigger. Hey, come on in. Very swish. Come in, guys. Yeah guys, let's just say it was a smooth drive and I had no issues. The only thing I was thinking about is how do I park it up here. But lucky enough, I uh, picked the right car because it fits perfect. So, Absolutely. Yeah. But yeah, I'm honestly going to love um, you know using this car. But being honest, I'm going to love... Whoa, that's clear. <laughs> you too. Um, I'm going to even love to get indoors because I'm actually sweating my knackers off. But yeah, so me and Yvonne's going to be having a little bit of a look around the car now and then we're going to get ourselves indoors. Definitely. Definitely. Wow, guys, it looks like we are not going to have a nice sunrise this morning because apparently we're going to have some rain today, which is fantastic for the environment but not good for when you've got things that you want to do after work. However, guys, I've got to confess the last week when I crashed my drone, I was absolutely mortified. This week, I've been doing some research to find out how much it will cost to repair it and everything. And I am absolutely gobsmacked, honestly. It will literally cost me more to fix my drone than to buy a brand new drone. And it's really made me go, for God's sake, so um, it looks like I'm going to have to uh, do so many more overtime hours in work in order to pay for that. Wow, guys, we have got ourselves some rain today. Don't know if there is a particular word for this, but I love the smell you get when it's been so hot and then you get the rain hitting the ground it gives off this really strange smell and it's really really nice anyways i gotta say that it's so nice today to be able to spend some time in my new car on my break and uh, i gotta confess i've been playing around with the uh, radio this morning i didn't realize there was that many dab stations out there so um i'm discovering different channels and uh, i'm going through and i'm like oh i like this i like this and this yeah i don't know it's just when you've got a new toy i suppose you want to play with everything on it oh uh, guys being honest this weather is making me very depressed 
because the way I feel, I really want to go out and do a little bit of ecotherapy. But on a bit of a positive note, I suppose it gives me more time to get some editing done and uh, spend a bit more time with, you know, Yvonne, catching up and seeing what she's been up to today. You know, maybe she might surprise me with something. The other day when she did some recorded of me and Sky coming home, that was really, really good. Yvonne, we want more of that. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god guys so cool now last night no word of a lie we had quite a lot of rain it's a fantastic test to see if this window is nicely sealed now on the inside i've had a look and this is what it looks like from the inside guys i've been looking at all the joints and everything and everything here and also on this side as well and i gotta confess it is absolutely staying perfect for us well anyway guys i'm on my way to work and today is going to be a different shift to my usual start um i'm starting at 11 o'clock in the morning which is really strange However, I am looking forward to getting my shift out of the way with today. And I've actually uh, had a little bit of a thought this morning. I might go out for a bit of a, a night walk. Unfortunately, guys, it looks like I'm not going to be able to go out after work after all, because it looks like it's going to persist it down, which isn't good for me. However, guys, right, I am definitely looking forward to getting home, have a nice little bit of relaxation. I'm hoping, guys, I'm going to be able to stay up and wake up for Yvonne when she gets home for work. How cool would that be? And not only that, guys, I'm hoping that I'm going to be able to catch up with all that editing and have a nice Saturday evening, a bit like what I wanted to do last week, guys. But anyways, let's go and see where Yvonne was at. Hello. Hello. <laughs> Located her. Well, anyways, I am definitely looking forward to getting out of here. Having a wonderful evening. Also, guys, I'm definitely looking forward to getting all that editing yeah. done. Well, guys, I am now switching off my PC. I have spent hours going over my vlog. And I'm hoping that you have enjoyed every part of it up to now. But let's just say, me and Technic is waiting up to see if uh, we can capture Yvonne coming home. Because the last time I did this was many, many, many vlogs ago. And uh, she had no clue, guys. So I had a camera set up in the uh, kitchen. And then I literally had my phone in my hand. And it was quite funny how I did it. And I really did enjoy doing that. But this time, I don't know if I'm going to be able to do that. Wow, guys, unfortunately, it's not coming up clear enough on camera. But the area that I'm pointing to there, the clouds look very sort of like orangey tinge. But then you come around here, in this section here where my hand is, that area there, it's really, really bright. So I have now just done my final checks, making sure everything's correct. So we want to come in the garage to come straight up the garden and then come into the house. And uh, to be truthfully honest, I am looking forward to uh, surprising Yvonne because I hope that she uh, gets a bit like, whoa, why are you still up? Because uh, she will be sending me a WhatsApp, guys. So what I'm thinking of doing is, uh, is literally staying in this room. Well, anyway, guys, it's that time she has sent me that message and she is now waiting for a taxi to get herself on her way home. And I must admit, I'm quite excited about doing this. And I'm hoping she's going to have a positive uh, response to this and uh, hopefully no foul language. Welcome home. The words bottom spring to mind. Really? really? Yes. Why does bottom spring to mind? Because that's a polite word. Compared to all this. <laughs> By the way, welcome home. Oh, thank you. Yeah, did you have a good shift? Yes. Yeah? Can I throttle you now or later? Promises, promises. Off, off camera, excuse me. Off camera, off camera. <laughs> yes. Well, anyways, I'm going to chill with Yvonne here and uh, hopefully get her heart rate a bit down. And, um... Enjoy a bit of time with her, and then it's going to be that time for me to hit the hay, as they say, because I am absolutely shattered. Yvonne, I have a question for you. Did you like last night? Uh, yes. And what did you like about it? <laughs> very unexpected. Really? Very, very 
Unexpected, yeah. <laughs> oh my God, guys. That was absolutely legend of me last night, what I did to her. And to be truthfully honest, we watched back the clip this morning and I was in fits of laughter and she was looking at me going, hmm. <laughs> Anyways, we're just going to finish off getting ourselves ready to get to work and uh, fingers crossed, we'll have an awesome shift. Wow, guys, the weather looks absolutely awful. I mean, Yvonne here, we're having our uh, break, and I must admit, it's actually it's starting to drizzle now as we're talking to you. Anyways, we're going to chill and have our break now, and uh, then it'll be that time to head back in. Go talk to me, OK? Yeah. Good girl. <laughs> anyway, guys. Hey, yeah, uh, bye-bye. Everyone's happy, everyone's going home, and uh, I can't wait to get home. I've got plenty of things to do, and I think it's just started to spit. Ugh, nasty, but it's very humid at the same time. I ain't got a clue, and apparently, I can't get my sleeve out, and apparently we're supposed to be getting some thunder or something. I ain't got a clue if that's true or not. Fingers crossed if we do, I'll be able to capture it. Wow, guys. So many hours seem to have passed without us even looking at the clock. And I gotta confess, we have done so much. We have had dinner, we have spoke to Yvonne's mum. Um, what else have we done? Um, you know when your you brain, know, just, brain goes, just goes... goes, goes. <laughs> 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 well, yeah, let's just say, you know, we've had a definitely a good day at work. We've got home, we've got stuff sorted out and done. As I said, we spoke to Yvonne's mum and that was... You know, I would say very uh, good because she told us some information about these uh, snakes and stuff because she's into watching all these programs like, what is it she watches, National Geographic or something like things that? Things like that, yeah. yeah she, and uh, like swamp things and yeah. this man is catching snakes barefooted. Oh God, That's no. just scary. That is, just makes my toes, no, no, like. just no. <laughs> oh God, no, that's just really made me feel like, ugh. Unfortunately, this is where me and Yvonne has to love and leave you. So we both want to say a huge thank you for coming by. It means the world to us. And always, guys, remember to do your best to stay positive and scroll those negatives. Oh yeah, baby. And we will see you on the next one. All right. Bye, bye, bye. 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 bye.